Hey guys, this is Sam, and today we've got a showdown between these two guys right here. Actually, gals, I should say. It is Amazon Alexa versus Apple Siri, and I'm very interested to see where their strengths and weaknesses lie. I want to do this test a little bit differently uh, than others might. So Apple Siri obviously integrates with the iPhone at a system level. You can say things like, remind me to do this because it uses the Reminders app, or call this person, open this app. Because Alexa doesn't integrate that way, it's obviously not fair at all to test those things. So I want to focus more on 12 simple-ish questions that I feel any voice assistant in 2017 should be able to handle. So we're going to kick it off right now with something pretty simple. Siri, how's the weather in Cupertino? Here's the forecast for Cupertino, California for today. All right, tells me a little bit about the weather. How's the weather in Cupertino, California? skies. Today, you can look for mostly sunny weather with a high of 75 degrees and a low of 48 degrees. So that's important to note right here is that everything you'll hear from Alexa is all auditory. She's not going to really show you any visuals considering the fact that she started on a speaker in the first place, the Amazon Echo. Where Siri started on the iPhone 4S, she's very visual, but we got the same information either way. Moving on to number two, what's 9 plus 10? The answer is 9 21. Uh, she got the right answer regardless. What's 9 plus 10? The sum of 9 and 10 is 19. The sum sound a little bit fancier, both exactly the same on that one. What movies are playing near me? I found a few movies playing today near Arnold. Alright, she gives me some movies. What movies are playing near me? All right, so Alexa doesn't want me to go to the movies. Let me try that again. What movies are playing near me? Here are a few movies playing near Arnold today. Beauty and the Beast, Kong, Skull Island, Logan, Get Out, The Lego Batman Movie, and The Shack. All right, that was cool. I liked how it was a weird glitch the first time, worked great the second time, basically got the same amount of information on both. Moving on to number four, what is today's date? I was a little worried about that one for some reason. Uh, Siri got it fine. What's today's date? Today is Friday, March 17th. Okay, perfect. Obviously, we know the year. Both the same once again. Number five. What time is sunset in New York? In New York, New York today. Sunset will be at 7.05 p.m. What time is sunset in New York? Okay, so interesting once again that we got different data. I guess they just have a different source, but between 704, 705, that is when the sun will be setting in New York, New York. Number six, flip a coin. Heads. Perfect. Flip a coin. Heads. All right, perfect. Both did exactly what I wanted to do. Moving on, we're going to turn up the heat just a little bit. What is March Madness? All right, so she gave me a Wikipedia article, March Madness was a pay-per-view out of sports package. Men's division, it's a championship? Okay, so I, I guess that gives me like some basic information. What is March Madness? The NCAA Men's Division I Basketball Championship, the single elimination tournament held each spring featuring 65 college basketball teams in the United States. Thanks. Um, for me, Alexa gets the W on that one. They were pretty close. They both told me that it was like NCAA Men's Division I like playoffs championship, but I liked how Alexa told me like it's every year. It happens in the spring. A little bit more detailed than what Siri could provide. And Siri also said it was like, uh, it was something, not like it's still going on, which is kind of interesting. All right, next up, who is the president? Okay, check it out. Oh no. No, Siri, no, she gave me a Wikipedia article for what a president is. Are you kidding me? No. Alexa, bring me home, please. Who is the president? The U.S. president is Donald Trump. All right, she gave me the answer, hands down, Alexa getting the W. Regardless of what your political views may be, that is the correct answer. Up next, 
Ooh, the ultimate showdown. The ultimate showdown. This is the only question if you've not watched anything else that you must pay attention to. Tell me a joke. I can't. I always forget the punchline. Tell me a joke. Chat boy, get serious. <laughs> Tell me a joke. Chat boy, I don't really know any good jokes. None. What? Siri, come on, it's 2017, get your head in the game. Tell me a joke. Two muffins are in the oven. One turns to the other and says, is it hot in here? The that. other muffin replies, what? A talking muffin? Weak, but it, it was a joke in, in Alexa's defense, like not the best. Let me see if she can get a good one. Tell me a joke. Clever, clever, clever. All right, Alexa taking the biggest W in history right there. Moving on, why is the sky blue? Here's some information. Wikipedia sky blue, sky blue is the name of a book. Oh. She gave me a Wikipedia entry for why the name of a color is sky blue. Hopefully Alexa can actually tell me. Why is the sky blue? The sky is blue because the molecules of the atmosphere scatter blue light more than other colors. So when you look away from the sun, more blue is knocked off course into your eyes. That's what I wanted to know. Alexa, once again, taking the W. Siri, not even close. I mean, I guess you can say sort of close because it was like a sky blue entry or entry in Wikipedia, but Alexa actually told me what it was. So pretty big W there. This is going to be pretty simple. Will you take over the world? This is about you, not me. All right, dodging the question, respectable. Will you take over the world? They both shifted it back to me because that's that's pretty fishy. We'll see what Apple and Amazon are doing over the next few years. How are the stocks today? Here's how the markets did. All right, she gave me Dow Jones, S and P, Nasdaq, basically everything I'd want to see. How are stocks today? Hmm. I can't find the answer to the question I heard. How are the stocks today? Oh, she gave me an hourly news report. All right, side note, hourly news report from Amazon Alexa with NPR is actually pretty cool. Gives you localized weather, then it'll tell you some broader headlines from the day. But as far as the stock market goes, I was looking for something like Dow Jones down this many points or up this many points. Um, she did not tell me the specific information I was looking for. So definitely Siri gets the W on that one. Alrighty guys, you saw it here first. Amazon Alexa killing it, absolutely destroying it when it comes to actual information like about the president or jokes or why the sky is blue um, or March Madness. She did really well in those categories. Siri definitely took the cake when it came to the stocks. Everything else, like one through five, about weather and numbers, they were exactly equal, and I got the right amount of information on both. But Alexa definitely really good with these more common sense questions about presidencies and, and basic info like that. So I wanna hear your thoughts about this down below. What do you think about this comparison? I was kind of shocked that Siri didn't know as much as, or didn't know as much as I feel like she should. And Amazon Alexa kind of blew me away. So if you guys enjoyed this, feel free to drop a like down below, and of course, subscribe. For more comparison videos like this in the future, I've been Sam, hope you guys are doing great, and I'll talk to you later.